Around 6.45 hours on Friday, tragedy struck in the Maruka River Region 1, Burimawaini, when a guard raider's craft 17 RC-17 vessel and a wooden Balahu boat collided. It resulted in the death of two persons, Adrian Thomas, an 18-year-old teacher of Kumaka Road, Santa Rosa Village, and Helen Rebai, 33, also a teacher of Waikribi Village, Region 1. Thomas was the captain of the wooden vessel, which was powered by a 75-horsepower outboard engine, while Rebai, her three-month-old baby, Denal, and another female, 28-year-old Shelley Allen, were passengers. The infant and Allen were injured. They were both admitted at the Charity Hospital for observation. There were three Coast Guard ranks on the RC-17 vessel, which was captained by Sergeant Carrington. The Coast Guard ranks were not injured. Police headquarters said preliminary investigations revealed that the Coast Guard vessel was heading to Santa Rosa while the Balahu boat was heading to Charity Esequibo when there was a collision while negotiating a turn near Kumaka. The newsroom on Friday spoke to Thomas' mother, Arlene Atkinson, who said that her son purchased the boat earlier this year. She was going out this morning, so after he left, felt me going. And, um, I said I hear that thing is still one of his friends. She husband is go out on the boat, so he called and said that he heard they had some accident with the 75. And they said the only 75 he going out was my son. Still later when I called her back, then she said, yes, it's true that he had, they had an accident and he died. He was going to the bank, to, um, was going to um, withdraw some money. They had... Um, this feeding program, he they, they in charge of the feed, free feeding program. So he went. He did. They, um, they were going out there. He's a teacher up in the White Caribbean, the Barama. So he just never be. He tell me um, he want a boat because it's be hard sometimes, you know. For when they had to come out, transportation is be hard. So he want his own boat. So he bought the boat and that was it. It really hurt me to know that my son so healthy. Had to meet his, um, his death like that. As a result of the collision, the Coast Guard vessel was damaged and is currently at the base in the Pomeroon River. The Ghana Police Force has launched an investigation into the incident. Reporting for the newsroom, Sharda Bacchus.